What's up guys, my name is Kaushik. Well, this video is a little bit different from what I usually do. So what happened was my friend called me in this weekend and he was like, Kaushik, can you do something which is really cool and really simple in one night? Well, that question intrigued me. Well, it's not like I haven't done that before, right? And it's, it's quite doable. And, uh, but this time I want to take it to next level. So I decided to make a video about it, video about how I approach a question how I get an idea and how I solve everything. Well, this this video is all about that. This time is well now, time is 11.40 and uh, I don't have an idea, you know. So we have an old night and we have one project to do. So without any further ado, let's search for an idea. Well, the time is now 12.18 AM. I think we are up to a new day. And I think I figured out what I want to do the whole night. There's this module called Media Pipe, which I used for my old projects. It's basically a AI module in Python for hand, face, post directions. So the, the documentation is pretty clear and the link will be in the description. And so I used my, in my old projects, I used the hand detection. So I wanted to use the same thing again because I'm familiar with it. And I've been searching for things which we do with our hands, which can be automated or which can be coded in. So. And my mind went to games like rock, paper, scissors, also even and everything. But they, they all seem pretty simple and pretty menial to be honest. Like it's, it's just after you have to code one, two, three, four, and there's no fun in it. There's, there's nothing cool in it. So I want to take it up a notch and I've been searching for games. And then I came across Angry Birds. We all know what Angry Birds game is. It's pretty famous. We all played it. So I want to change the controls of the way we play Angry Birds game in our desktop. So usually we use the mouse pad or mouse to play with, but now I think we have to use our hands. Without any further ado, let's just, I think, jump into the implementation. Well, coming to implementation part, before we jump into the code, I always like to write down what all steps to do I need and everything. And I want to figure out that what I'm supposed to do the next three to four hours. So what are we going to do? So we have to open Facebook and open the Angry Birds game in it. And we have to wait until the Angry Birds game is loaded. We have to open a level and we have to change the controls of the Angry Birds game. Well, this is where the tricky part is. So what I'm thinking is, instead of mouse down and slide, how about a pinch? So pinch and slide. So this will be the mouse down thing and you can move it and mouse up. That's pretty cool, I guess. So <laughs> I'm pretty much excited to start the coding part. So let's just jump into it. Bring the funk back. like a family tree part of you and part of me and if we should separate go your own way I won't wait
two hours later. Well, it's almost three o'clock, and I've 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 made everything up and running. So I used Pyodo GUI to open Facebook and do the mouse click buttons and everything, and I used Media Pipe for my uh, for my hand detection. So everything is work up and running. But there is a problem actually. I'm. It's really hard for me to make the cursor move exactly the way I wanted it. It's pretty much fluctuating from time to time. Uh, I think it requires some fine tuning. So let's see. Let's see what's gonna happen. Okay, it's almost fine now and I think I'm, yeah, I'm not able to think properly as well but yeah, let's just run the code and check. It's not it's not working perfectly yet, there are so many fluctuations which are happening. So let's see, let's see. What's that? One second, let me run. Okay. Okay, so it's logging into the Facebook Angry Birds thing and I am already currently logged in so don't be asking any credentials so I didn't code for it. Now, well, it depends on the mobile network, so I couldn't actually wait, like write a code to wait and do the, do the automation, so I'm just gonna do it manually. Uh, so let's see. So let, let, the, let the entire Angry Birds game load and I'll show you how the code works. Yep. Yep. So I guess we are ready, so let's just uh, say yes here, or yes or whatever, like you can just code it whatever you want to code it. So let me just short my screen so that I know that I'm doing the correct controls so yeah so my hand is there pinch go up and go oh wow that's that's first two okay that's nice so yeah that's how it works guys so I think it's working properly so I'm sorry I'm just moving my hand and it's moving out so yeah that's how it's working guys